Hey, why is the er sound in girl stronger than the er sound in answer? Maybe because these are two different sounds. In this American English pronunciation video, we'll discuss two different R colored American vowel sounds, the strong er and the weak er. Welcome to my channel, guys, and please don't forget to subscribe. Let's get to the video now. In American English, whenever in the same syllable, the letter R is preceded by a vowel. It forms a new sound unique to American English. These are called R-colored vowel sounds, and yes, there are more than one, but we will be discussing two of them today, the strong er and the weak er. Okay, let's go back to what we were talking about in the beginning of the video. Let's compare girl with answer. Girl, answer. Girl, er, and er, er. Do you get it? The first one that is girl has a stronger, deeper, longer, er. In answer, it's smoother, shorter. It's er, girl, answer, girl, answer. So how do you identify it? Whenever er is found in an unstressed syllable, that's the weaker er. Okay guys, before we go ahead with more examples, I want to quickly tell you what syllables are. Words in English are made of smaller sound units. These are called syllables. Let me show you what I mean with the help of a few examples. Let's look at the word banana. B -na -na. Let's look at the word computer. Com -er. And let's look at the word cat. C-A-T, cat. Cat's got one syllable. Computer has three syllables. And banana as well has three syllables. Now, if you see, we are not stressing on a specific part of the word cat because it's only one unit. But for banana and computer, we are stressing the middle syllable. But nana. The middle na is stressed. That's called a stressed syllable. We only stress one syllable in a word. We do not stress all syllables equally. That's called syllable stress. Now that's a completely different topic and it requires probably more than a video or two. That's not what we are doing today. Our topic is the weak er and the strong er sound. Let's look at the examples of author, prosper, better. We don't say author, prosper. We don't say better. We say author because er in each of these is, an un, is in an unstressed syllable. I would never say I want to be an author. I want to prosper. This shirt's better. I'd say, I want to be an author. I want to prosper. This shirt's better. Let's look at a few examples with the weak er sound. You can repeat after me so that you're able to identify. Leather. Hammer. Honor. Glamour. Capture gather. Which er sound do you think is prevalent in these words? Of course, the weak er sound. That's because we are not saying leather, hammer, honor, gather, capture, or glamour. It'll be really weird if you switch the two er sounds between words. It would tell the listener that you're not a native speaker. So please remember, whenever you find er, the sound er, in an unstressed syllable, it is the weak er sound. And when you find it in a stressed syllable, that's the strong er sound. 
Okay, let's look at the words figure, flavor, favor, creditor, error, terror. Which or sound do you think is prevalent in these words? Yes, once again, it's the weak er sound. We don't say figure. I'm going to figure this out. We don't say that. We say, I'm going to figure this out. We don't say, uh, this ice cream's got a great flavor. We don't say, uh, I need you to do me a favor. We say, I need you to, I need you to do me a favor. Er. Flavor. Er. Figure, er, similarly, error, er, terror, er. All of these are weak er sounds because they are not in a stressed syllable in the word. To understand this even better, let's look at the words dollar, doctor, beginner, dinner. Eager. Which er sounds prevalent here? Of course, the weak er sound. We don't say, I need a doctor. Do you have a dollar? Do you want to have dinner? We say dinner, er, dollar, er, beginner, er, doctor, er, er. Short, smooth, quick. The weak er sound. Because in each of these words, the er sound is in an unstressed syllable once again. Let's compare the word center with universe. Sen er. Universe. Which one do you think's got the stronger er and which one do you think has the weaker er sound? Yes, you're correct. Universe has the strong er sound and center has the weak er sound. Both of these sound er, but once again, the weak er is quicker, shorter, smoother, and the strong er is longer, deeper, and darker. Let's look at a few more words now with the strong er sound. Let's look at the words learn, nurse, Curd, serve, pearl, worse, worse, er, worse, er, purse, er, purse, pearl, er, pearl, turn. Er, turn, nurse, nurse, er, nurse, er, nurse. This is a strong er sound because in each of these words, the er is located in the stress syllable. Let's try and compare it with girl, curl. Turn, burn. Do you think that this has the stronger or the weaker er? This has the stronger because we are saying girl, er, curl, er, burn, er. How's that? Okay, you've got it now. The strong er is longer, deeper, and stronger. You spend more time on that. The weak er is shorter, quicker, and smoother. Let's take a look at a few more examples. Okay, let's look at the word S I R, sir. Er, sir. Let's look at H E R, her. Er, her. Attorney, attorney, attur, er, attorney. Flirt, 
flirt, flur, er, flirt, world, world, er, world, absurd, absurd, er, absurd. Okay, let's look at furniture, fur, er. Furniture. Circle. Circle. Er. Circle. Purple. Per. Er. Purple. Circus. Sir. Er. Circus. Church. Er. Church version er version furnace fur er furnace. If you've liked this video, please share, subscribe, like, comment, whatever you want to do. And I'll see you next time. Till then, stay safe.